Hey, good afternoon, everybody. Happy Friday. Just a few things, and then we'll uh, get right to your questions. And another demonstration of our enduring commitment, earlier today, the Department of Defense announced $2 billion in additional security assistance for Ukraine under the Ukraine Security Assistance Initiative. The security assistance package reaffirms the steadfast support of the United States for Ukraine by committing additional unmanned aerial systems and counter UAS and electronic warfare detection equipment, as well as critical ammunition stocks for artillery and precision fires capabilities that will bolster Ukraine's ability to repel Russian aggression. Is the anticipation that it would be there in time for the offensive this spring? Uh, I, I think, I, I don't think that would be the case. Again, we're already providing them with a significant amount of capabilities coming from PDA along with the international community uh, to get them the capabilities they need for the springtime. Uh, but again, this is a fight uh, that will continue uh, to be tough. And so we want to ensure not only are we meeting their immediate needs, but we're also meeting their medium and long-term needs. And so, again, we're going to rush to get these capabilities there as quickly as we can. Um, in, the, in the package, as you highlight, uh, the, the laser-guided rocket systems, uh, those are advanced precision kill weapon systems. So essentially, uh, the ability to convert unguided rockets into precision-guided munitions, uh, which can be operated from various launchers uh, that we're providing to the Ukrainians. So the equipment plus the training uh, which includes operations, maintenance, and sustainment, gives the Ukrainians the capabilities they need not only to defend, but also to go on the offensive on their timeline uh, in order to change the equation on the battlefield. Thanks.